My bad for saying that. Are we hit? Are we good? Guys. Hello? Are you guys here? Fuck off, man. Fuck off. Okay, okay. Of course, of course my PlayStation had, it had to do that when we were in the middle of a fucking classic. Hang on, guys. I'm mad. I was so mad, man. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. What's your guys' thoughts on what we're seeing so far, though, guys? This is fucking cinema. We are seeing Oscar, Mercedes, Blossom. Blossom. Did I, say just, did I just say Blossom twice? Who the hell do we have? It's Mercedes, Oscar, um, Blossom, Mabel. Bro, Asuka is pulling something off right now. I don't even... How's Zoe? Zoe's in there. I don't... You know what? I don't give a shit who wins, to be honest. I don't really give a shit. Like, if Asuka loses, I'm gonna be fine. Because they've been putting on... I mean, Asuka still has, like, three-hour chances. But... Fuck, man. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready to get back into this? Let's... You guys ready? Let's go. Wait! Mercedes eliminated by Zoe! Has been eliminated. Mercedes is out! And Mabel's about to be eliminated! Mabel's out! Has been oh no, they're teaming on Oscar! They're teaming on Oscar! Fuck! Yeah! Blossom! Blossom! Let's go, Blossom! Let's go, Blossom! Let's go, Blossom! Oh my, no! Let's go, Blossom! Bloss? Man. The Oscar dream hangs on. Blossom just the Blossom just made the save of a lifetime. Bloss I think Dark Mark is happy right now. Blossom. So he's about to be eliminated, I think. Yeah, <gasps> Oscar Oscar might win. Oscar has two finishers! There goes Zoe! There goes Zoe! And Oscar! Oh no, Oscar! Oh no! Blossom was ready! Ooh! Blossom! This reverse by Oscar! Come on! Come on! But oh, Blossom reverses! Come on! Come on! Oh shit! Oh shit! Come on, Oscar! If Blossom wins. I'm gonna, I won't be mad. I just know Oscar's gonna make it soon. Oh yeah, she's out. She's out. And Blossom qualifies. I don't care, Oscar. You know what? Here I'm not mad. Winner, I'm not Chandler. mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. We just seen something magical in that ring. I'm not mad. I'm not even mad. 
Blossom did as well as Oscar. I'm not even mad. But oh my god. Oscar's look. It's alright. Don't be mad. Don't be mad. Blossom definitely deserves to be Blossom's really good. Which dark you gotta be happy for Blossom. Blossom saved it. It could have been over earlier. Dark, it could have been over earlier, but Blossom made the save for your girl. So basically, I'm not even mad. Not mad. But... I'm gonna be honest. That Women's Chamber match is looking fucking... It's gonna be a fucking banger. It has Dawn, Sheeta, and Blossom. Those three are fantastic in the ring. It's gonna slap. And I imagine that Asuka will be in that match. I imagine so. There's no way she isn't. Yes, we are. And Molly or Heather is gonna join them. But let's talk let's run down predictions, everybody. We're still gonna do some qualifiers. So after after the show, we should have two more people that need to qualify for that chamber. Two more people that need to qualify. Who do you guys think the final two people... You, oh, yeah, guys. Who do you guys think will be the final three qualifiers? It'll be Ramali or Heather or two other people. Just guess. I'm going to be honest. I think Oscar will make it, though. I think Oscar's going to make it. There's no way she doesn't. After that performance, there's no way she doesn't. I'm thinking, who do you guys, all right, you know, we'll talk about them when we run down the card. So, um, yeah, guys, let's run down the card, all right? What time is it? It's 8.05. All right, we're about to get this shit underway. But who will win? Will it be Bird and Alex or the Usos? Who will win? Will it be Bird and Alex getting another victory? Or does the Usos break the streak? And, the, and, and what, what we heard yesterday that this is the last match that Bird and Alex will wrestle until Scent Mania. So I imagine they will go they, they'll come I imagine they'll confront each other next week. At this point I'm not sure. I mean yeah. And to be honest, I don't care who wins. It's gonna slap. Yeah. Hand. I'm still surprised you're cheering for the hand after you turn your back on. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to guess. The op I don't think we're going to get a lot of predictions for that, by the way. We're probably not going to get a lot of predictions for that match. Because it's kind of, you know. But. Ooh, here's another one. This is a hard one, but this is this match is going to this match is going to slap. We're going to see Bluey go one-on-one -on -one with Sack Sabre Jr. in the IC title ladder match preview with Khan on commentary. Who will win? Will it be Bluey or Sack Sabre Jr.? That is kind of hard, to be honest. You don't give a fuck who wins. Yeah. So many ma these, some of these matches today are like, who? I don't give a fuck who they win. Because they're just going to fucking slap, you know? They're going to fucking chill. They're going to steal the show, you know? You're going to say Bluey? Yeah. I think Bluey's looking the like Bluey's looking really good going to Scent Man. And Zack Sabre Jr. is doing great stuff right now. But, I, once again, we're going to see Zack... Brian Danielson and Sack Sabre Jr. are going to be in the same ladder match. Can you guys imagine? 
Like that, like they're gonna tear the roof off. To be honest, at Scent Mania. All right, now here's the one that will. F all right, here's the one that won't be. I don't give a fuck. All right, this won't be like. All right, I know answer. Really easy answer. Who will win? Will it be Lucita or War Girl? <laughs> Lucita or War Girl. <laughs> I, I'm expecting the answer. I am expecting. <laughs> What's this? Obviously, War Girl. Obviously, you know? Obviously. Obviously, it's going to be War Girl. There's no way Lucita's going to win, you know? <laughs> What's this? Alright, I'm expecting. Alright, Lucita. Yeah, Luc yeah, Lucita. There's no way Lucita doesn't win. What's this? Oh, all right, all right. I was not expecting that. 50, 50, 50. <laughs> this, if ending's a 90 10, to be honest. It's a 90 10, to be honest. <laughs> it's a 90 10 on Lucia. She's fucking killing her. <laughs> I imagine. There's no, there's no way she loses to War Girl. I mean, War Girl eliminated all of the um, hands girls, eliminated Eo, and she also eliminated Liv. Was it Liv or Alexa? I think it was, I think it was Liv. And then Alexa got eliminated later on. Doesn't matter though. Doesn't change about that. Then today we're gonna hear from Dark Mark. I've heard he, there's some very interesting stuff. There's some very interesting stuff that Dark Mark wants to say here today. That's going to sound real. It's going to be good. That's all I'm going to say. I kind of have a feeling it's going to be good. Then, we're going to have a sit-down interview with the, um, I was supposed to say number one contender, but there's no number one contender. <laughs> I'm so brain dead for that. But, we're going to have a sit-down interview for with Matthew Grantlin before his match with Brian O'Dell at Scent Mania. We're going to sit down with Matthew Grantlin, and we're going to talk about what's his feelings going to the show. Then, we're going to see Macho Studios go one-on-one -on -one with that red monster that isn't Kane or isn't Clifford. Elmo! Who will win? Will it be Elmo or will it be Macho Studios? And Macho Studios has a date. Not that type of date. If you think, what, if you think that's what I'm talking about, you're fucking weird. He has a chance to take that U.S. title off of Nathan Barker. Macho. Macho. Yeah, macho. 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 I don't think he even knows to get in the shot yet. I'll tell him next time he's in the chat. But, macho. The he yeah, the macho's the favorite. Here's one. This is this might be interesting. We're going to see Molly go one-on-one -on -one with Heather in a women's, a women's chamber qualifier. Who's going to join Blossom... Dawn and Akaru Shida. Will it be Molly or Heather? Also to mention, they're both former women's champions. Heather is overall 100. The overall doesn't really matter though, to be honest. Elmo, like, Ma, you're, Ma, um, yeah, Macho's overall, like, 80-something, I think. And then Elmo's, like, 91. You're gonna say Molly? Or Macho for that match? I'm gonna say, experience-wise, Molly. But strength? I'm sorry, Molly, but I'm gonna say Heather. It's kind of tough, though. Like, if... We'll see. I, I, I think... I think it's gonna be Heather. Yeah, it's gonna be. I think. I think it's gonna be Heather. I think Heather's gonna beat Molly, unfortunately, for Molly. Like, like, 
I say Heather. Yeah. I, I'm i sorry, Molly. But Heather. I mean, uh, Molly, well. Molly isn't as, yeah, Molly isn't as, you know. She's more innocent than the meal. <laughs> the meal, like, the meal. Molly didn't want to go back with the meal. The meal fucking. <laughs> he, the meal pulled a, um. The meal pulled a, um. Dom and Maria. Like, not really, but not really that, you know. Like, fucking, the meal hypnotized Molly to come back. Alright. Damn, we're gonna see. Oh, this is gonna be good. We're gonna see Bork Lasser and Brock Lesnar come face to face here today. Woohoo! So Bork and Brock will meet face to face. Let's see what they gotta say. What the hell is your username? Uh, it's just it, I don't give a shit anymore. I changed it like a few, like I changed it about nine months ago, and I, I haven't bothered changing it back since. One thing to expect: violence. Maybe, maybe, maybe if they if they want if they want to fight each other. <laughs> That's gonna be so fun. All right, then we're gonna see Hangman Page go one on, yeah, Hangman Adam Page go one on one with Sonic. This is gonna be a good match, I think. I think this will be a good match, and the winner of this match will join Neon, Joe Hendry, and um, yeah, Neon, Joe Hendry, Trey. Hello, Ryan. How are you, Ryan? Today's a big night for you. If you win tonight. Then you are gonna fish to go to Scent Mania. Who's holding your back? Well, that's Mickey. And um, oh, oh, that's for the actually time. Yeah, we're gonna turn the other people to the chamber. Well, we got Trey, Neon, and Joe Hendry for the chamber. I'll win. Yeah, Ryan, do it for everybody here today. Oh yeah, Ahmed. Wait. I think I'm gonna do that. We'll see that. But right, I'll talk. Well, all right. So I guess everybody's saying. I guess everybody's gonna say Ryan is beating Special Agent Oso with Cody Rhodes fan, aka Mr. Cody. And by the way, hope he's doing okay. And um, as a special guest ref, I assume that's it. I mean, I assume so. There's no way Sonic loses the Hangman. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I think Sonic's winning. I love Hangman, but I think Sonic's winning. If, bruh. Neon and Sonic in the same chamber. And Joe Hendry in the chamber. Oh, yeah, Ryan, Joe Hendry's, Joe Hendry's in the chamber. <laughs> Let's go. And then Chef was second, right? Chef? Yeah, it was Chef second, and then Chef's getting a shot against Shaggy to get into the chamber today. Which brings me... Never mind. So, I think it's kind of tied... Ryan, yeah. All right. Who will win? Will it be Cody Rhodes, the American Nightmare, or Kid Bandit? Who will win? Will it be Cody Rhodes or Kid Bandit? Did somebody say Joe Hendry? I did just say Joe Hendry. Yeah, Ryan, listen to this. The chamber as of right now is Trey, Joe Hendry, Neon, and it'll either be Heyman and Sonic or Shaggy. And Chef. And if the people I think will come out on top, that is going to fucking slap. That will be, like, really good. Like, we're going to have some fuck. We're going to have a really good chamber match. Kid Bandit, out of respect for Cody Rhodes. Stat Chamber. Stat Chamber. Ryan, listen to this. Your girl, Karushita, qualified for the women's chamber. And she's joined Dawn... And Blossom, two very talented people. I was about to say two talented talents, but that didn't make sense. Basically, the chambers are stacked so far. And Molly or Heather might join. And then listen to this. You know what? And Axiom almost qualified for the IC title ladder match. But Brian Danielson won, so that's not bad. Basically, the IC title ladder match is Khan, Bluey, 
Brian Danielson, Ricky Starks, and Zack Saber Jr. Like you're hearing it, bro. Brian Danielson and Zack Saber Jr. in the same ladder match, along with Bluey. Like, out, out, out. Obviously, one of the best talents right now in ring. To be honest. Basically, all of the multi-man matches are stacked right now. I imagine that's going to be in the chat. <laughs> Alright, let's talk about the show, though. So, I imagine... Alright, here we go. Who will win? Will it be Shaggy or Chef? Shaggy or Chef, guys. I'm saying Man is going to be the best show we've ever put on. Who will win? Will it be Shaggy or Chef? Whew. Oh. Damn, I was expecting more things there. I was expecting that. Is my chat broken? No, it's not. Alright. Chef? Yeah. Ex I'm, I, you know what? Chef's massive. A lot, oh, we got two chefs. I was expecting more Shaggies, to be honest. Shaggy, I think Shaggy's gonna win. Yeah, Shaggy. Like, Shaggy's a former world champion. Dude has beat, like, the... He beat Pingu in his prime. Like, no one could do that but Shaggy. Like, who's gonna beat Shaggy in... I mean, who's gonna beat Pingu in his prime? Like, Pingu was a fucking monster. And Shaggy has somehow fucking beat him. Austin mentioned Shaggy. Shaggy's had matches with Pingu. Shaggy had a rematch with Pingu. I think Shaggy beat Pingu again. I think. Shaggy, I think the only, like... He did lose to Ahmed. Shaggy did lose to Ahmed. And he lost to Big Tiger for the world title. Because, yeah, yeah, Shaggy lost the world. And Scoop... Yeah! Scooby-Doo lost, yeah, and guys, if you guys don't remember, Shaggy and Scooby-Doo had a fucking uh, blood in the water match, which was basically a death match at Prairie to Gateway, which Prairie to Gateway, be on the lookout, that's all I'm gonna say. Shit's about to hit the fan. <laughs> oh, oh, you guys will have to, more details will be revealed soon, but we have a lot of big shows coming up. With the recent announcement that MEW Beach Blast is in Australia. But guys, we still got more predictions to do. So, who will win? Will it be Red Dragon or the Young Bucks? Red Dragon or Young Bucks? This will be a good match. Red Dragon, Young Bucks, so we're tied. Young Bucks, Red Dragon? Yeah. It's kind of tough. Red Dragon was down horrendously. Like, if you were, say, if you were doing predictions like last... Last year, like it would, like you would say, young bucks, because Red Dragon were uh, like they had no wins, and but only now this year they're starting to rack up some wins. They did well in the tag team tournament. They made it to the semifinals, I believe, and they lost. Who did they lose to? Neon and Sonic, I think. Yeah, it was Neon and Sonic they lost to, which Neon and Sonic is a fucking great team, and they won the tournament. So. Alright. And then, we're going to announce that the MEW Spectre card, which will be stacked. And then we have the updated set mini card. There's only going to be one thing left to set, and will we'll be revealed by the end of the night. By the end of the night. And then our main event, Ryan Vis Quest for Special Asia Oso. We've already, pretty much already done predictions, and everybody, pretty much, I think everybody said Ryan. So, that's your card here today, guys. Here we go. Because it's time for MEW Spectre. Give me a hell yeah if you're ready. Here we go. So I'm going to end the stream.
I'll see you guys over there in just a second. So, bye guys.